the cat and the mouse under the Christmas tree. The room was filled, but a bit sad. The tree, with all the starlight and homemade ornaments, stood by the grandfather clock. This Christmas Bitsy was missed. Bitsy, the cat, had added love and fun to the home for 15 years. Now Tiffy enjoyed her first Christmas with the family. Tiffy was part Persian, part Dabby, and part Alley Cat, with many shades of long gray fur. But the best description was her gentleness, her ability to pick up objects with her paws, and the three BS Big Baby, Big Bitty, and Big Bottom. Tiffy had just pawed a Christmas ornament to the floor. As the ornament rolled toward the nativity scene, Tiffy noticed a mouse trying to hide behind the magi. The mouse bolted, but Tiffy blocked its way. With Tiffy playfully pawing at its tail, the mouse capered under a red wagon, and then in a pile of colorfully ribboned boxes. Not letting a mouse have all the fun, Tiffy jumped over the wagon and slid into the middle of the gifts, scattering them like a child's blocks. What fun! What a delight to be alive and a cat! Spotting the mouse running along the baseboard, Tiffy leaped over a toy fire engine and stopped the frightened mouse. With her paws, Tiffy playfully, but gently, pushed the little mouse back and forth from one paw to the other until the mouse was exhausted. Sitting like a squirrel, Tiffy picked up the mouse from the floor, but the mouse made no sound or movement. Tiffy held the little creature gently for a few seconds and softly said, Meow, then she put her newfound playmate carefully on the floor. And Tiffy watched the mouse disappear into Christmas darkness. Mom had watched in disbelief at this small drama. Then Tiffy felt Mom's loving arms around her and heard a whisper. What a gentle Tiff, I really wanted another short-haired calico, but when I saw you, I thought to myself, what a beautiful cat. How I wish Bitsy could have seen this tree. Come on, mine Tiffer, tomorrow will be a big day. The morning sun shone through crystal animals on the windowsill that created tiny bits of rainbows on the Christmas tree ornaments. The whole family came down to find Tiffy by the clock, looking at the tree. When the packages were opened, Tiffy played with ribbons and bow. She picked up a bow with her paw, put it in her mouth, and went to the kitchen. She laid it on her food tray. Tiffy wanted the mouse to come out and share the fun with her. But the little mouse remembered what its mom had told it about the other cat, the mighty hunter, Bitsy. 